for the double front squat, um, whether you're using 214K or 216K, that's a lot of weight in kettlebell, in kettlebell form in the front. You know, remember kettlebells are a little um, more unwieldy than like say a dumbbell and definitely than a barbell. So it's a different skill set. And these actually might feel a little bit heavier. So we're gonna use a lot of power to get the bells up so that we can maintain form. And we're only doing, when we, do, when we get tested, like four or five reps. So you can use a lot of hard style tension and then shake it out afterwards because we're not doing a lot of reps. I don't really like to use too much tension unless we need to. But you know, when you're, you have 70 pounds worth of iron wrapped in front of you, you need some power. So we're gonna clean the bowels, right? Go into our squat, inhale down, and then I want you to start breathing hard, that um, hard style breath now. Okay, so it gets harder and sharper at the end, but it's a progressive build, okay? So inhale down, okay? Inhale down, and I'm snapping the quads, okay? Another thing you wanna make sure is squeeze those shoulder blades and keep a nice open chest. So inhale down, open chest, inhale down, okay? Work on that in the workouts, do it with 12Ks first, and then save the 16K for when you really feel warmed up but you don't have to do all the rounds with a 16. Even though you can physically do it, I want you to practice it with the lighter belts, okay?